Hi, Kurt Suse here. I came across a pretty interesting feature of the Microsoft Classroom environment. I suggested a self-enrollment into the Microsoft Classroom courses a while ago, and then I started to play around a bit with my environment. And let me show you what I mean. I've created a course called Rebel Course, and here I got some course members, and I naturally can edit and add course members here in the administration pane. But I tried something different. I tried if a student can self-enroll into my course. And let's see, here I got the student Luke Skywalker. And he can look for a group, as Microsoft Classrooms are not are just groups in the back end. And he can find this rebel course and as he opens the the group conversation he can request to join the group so let me join the group or the aliens <laughs> Okay, and now coming back to the teacher view, so let's switch this and I go back to this teacher. As you could see, I get a request that Luke Skywalker wants to join the course and I can simply join him. Okay. And naturally, this, this is all based on, on the Office 365 groups. And let's switch back to the Microsoft Classroom and refresh the page. And of course, Luke Skywalker has joined the Microsoft Classroom course. So this is pretty awesome, in my opinion, because now you have the possibility that students can self-enroll into courses. And I'm thinking of, of open online courses within your school environment where you can make use of this. So let's double check this with the OneNote class notebook, for example. And I will surely switch to the OneNote class notebook. And let's see if this has Luke Skywalker, a Luke Skywalker section in it. And as you can see, here is the section for Luke Skywalker. And he's a full member of this classroom course. So that's all good. And let's switch back to the student. Let's see if he got an email. Okay, I'll switch to Luke's email. Once again. Okay, let's try this one. Okay, there's no information that he has joined the group, but you could see on the groups pane that here he's now a group member of the Rebel course. And let's dig into the Microsoft Classroom environment. Okay, here we go. Where to find it? Here we go. And of course, he's a member of this classroom. Uh, I have not activated the classroom, the Rebel classroom. Let's activate it for just a moment. Uh, here we go. And now let's refresh the students view and here it is and he can access as a full member of the classroom Microsoft classroom course he can access all the course note notes the calendar the group notes and even the files on the group OneDrive so that's pretty interesting as I um, 
talked about to create some open online courses and I think uh, that this could be further advanced with, with some self-enrollment um, links or even uh, some codes but it's uh, a good start uh, if you want to create online courses within the Microsoft Classroom environment that is accessible to all students. Thanks for watching.